Welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls. Let's hollow out this tree. Alright. We found our way down once, and then we got punched by a mushroom. Yeah. We need to be a little bit more careful this time. A little bit more uh, conservative, and uh, let's not get back to do a corner this time. I didn't think we were in too much of a corner. They just... There were more than one, and they well, punched they, you a good one. Well, they backed me up against a wall, and, well, that didn't help me as much, and that thing's dead. Yeah, yeah, what are those things? Uh, those things, they get, they're the things that give you the twinkling titanite and all that rare stuff. Yeah. Uh. Well, that's nice of them. Uh. There we go. <laughs> I thought we were too heavy to get over the ledge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ugh. Let's just go down the normal way here, not do anything too crazy. Well, too crazy. I think we could have made that. Making that. I. You would think English wasn't my first language with how much I flub it up. Just talking normally. There we go. Alright, All let's right. kill these basilisks. Beautiful Sounds guy. like a blast. With their disgusting curse face. I hate it. I hate these things. Ha -ha. I mean, ha ha! There we go. Yes, this is good. Basilisks. Good for the curse resistance. What if every time you killed one of those, you got better at resisting curses? That would be neat. Oh, actually, can you drop down from the other side? I'll drop down up here. Well, not. I don't want you to kill yourself, but it looks like there was a ledge. What do you mean? Uh, so, turn, turn around. Yep. Turn around. So, right there where that drop-off is? Right here? Yes. Yeah. Like, well, no. No, not exactly. Oh my god, Estes. I have no idea how we lived through that. Don't don't ask questions. But I am Just very glad. Just heal thine self. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Mm. Oh, hey, look, a summon sign. That's just a regular message. No, no, Fuck. no, no, Fuck. no, why would you... No, no. I messed it up. That no, was... no. I'm sorry. I'm so oh, sorry. All those souls, we had like 70,000. It doesn't matter. I can get more. Yeah, you but you that. didn't have to work for those. So, <sighs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. Because now we can be a little bit, uh... Yeah. We can be a little crazy now. Let's just do what you do in your other file. Yeah, fuck around. <laughs> Will I make it this time? Nope. Alright. At least nothing was lost. Now we've got nothing to lose, literally. Alright. Yeah, so now we don't have to be careful. You're right. You're right. Hey, guys. Hello. Hey, Hello. Do you want to dance? dance for a second? Uh, yep. Then I, yep. Then I, yep. Easy. Easy! <laughs> I don't know why I'm thinking of this, but, uh... Have, how far did you get in Metal Gear Rising Revengeance? I beat it. Okay. You know the line, Nano Machine's son, right? Of course. I saw a picture where somebody... drew, uh, Raiden... or, uh, Raiden as Doug, and the president as Mr. Tank. It's like, <laughs> it's Nano Machine's son! It's Nano Machine's son! It's Nano Machine's <laughs> Douglas! Very expensive. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, just uh, just us talking about old cartoons earlier, like Scooby-Doo and the like, just for some reason that popped into my head. I just I saw Bang It on the Trash Can earlier today for like the first time <laughs> in like, I don't know how many dozens of years. It was pretty special. I'm gonna hey, ask, did you just... I gotta ask you fuck something. Fuck off, what? How long have those ladders been there? I don't know. But I think I just managed to find the right one. It's hard to, to find the way down because it's very confusing. <laughs> Ah, uh, jeez, get over here, man. Come here. Shit, come on. Come here. There. That I can get you without locking on. Oh, look. Another ladder. Who was the nice person to set up all these ladders for us? Some guy in Dark Souls 2. Oh, seriously? Yeah, there's a ladder maker in Dark Souls 2. Wow. There's a big, huge, gigantic hole in the first, uh... In the, in the first town. I honestly did not think there would be a canonical reason for ladders being here. But it proved me wrong. Well, I don't know why the ladders are here, but that's how they are in Drang Lech, where Dark Souls 2 takes place. Drang Lech. Drang Lech. 
just rolls right off the top, doesn't it? Turns it into a bow and then just... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so far so good. Let's be a little bit more careful now in taking on these uh, fuck-ass mushrooms. Official names. Official names, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, that was that was directly from Hidetaka Miyazaki. Right. Mm. So do you think Shadow Just Die Twice is going to be anything close to this? I mean, I know it already looks like a Souls game, but I mean, like, this amount of polish. I think they know what they're doing, especially if it's led by Hidetaka Miyazaki, who I haven't played a game I hated yet from him. I just find it funny that they, they mentioned, hey, we're not making another Souls game, but have this. But it's going to be radically different. It's more vertical, well, true. more stealthy, kind of going around. The way, that, the way that death works is a little bit different. It actually reminded me a lot of Bloodborne, just like how fast it is. Yeah, I think, though, uh, at least uh, the prototype that they were showing, that... Okay. Aggro them a little bit. And now, the backing up commences. Anyway, it, it looks like it's going to be like Souls, but a little, just a little bit different. And the way that death works, like when you die, everyone gets de aggroed. But then if you've hit enough enemies, you can, like, come back, I guess. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Almost. Checking uh... back up here. Alright. So there's one. Alright, he's winding up. Whoosh. Ooh. The little baby's yeah. pushing their daddy. Okay, winding up. Alright, back up a little more here. Oh, you're getting caught in the corner again. Yeah, I think this is the corner where I might have died. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. Now, what do those little guys do? They're just the babies. They don't hurt you or anything? They don't hurt as much. They can still hurt you, though. Yeah, yeah. Okay. This is Dark Souls, of course they can. Well, they, you know, I had hope. Got nope, him. That's two. I think there's... Yep, one more coming up here. Back up. Well, I can actually see them winding up their next attack. It's kind of neat. Well... Shit. <laughs> <laughs> there! I hope you learned something from that. Oh, Whoop. back up. Phew, that was close. Yeah. Just in time. Just in the nick of time. Owie. Ow. Ow. Hey, okay. Quit. I'm gonna avenge my dad! Pushes Whew. you off the cliff. That was... That should not have been that, like, stressful. That was minorly stressful, but I think we handled it, and now we're good, and now we're at the bottom. And... I'm going to assume there's no bonfire for, like, another ten hours. I don't know. I don't really remember this place. Oh, good. New territory. In a manner of speaking. Oh. That doesn't look good. Oh, please, no. Okay, good. Alright. Oh, lovely. Hmm. More tree. Ash oh. Lake. Oh. <gasps> I have been here. I see it. I have been here before. I see yes. it. It's just, it's, oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's the best sight. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, I think there's a, that looks cool. I'm pretty sure that is a boss over there. Like, in that tree? I think. Oh, there he oh. is. It's just another Hydra. Oh. Well, uh, grab that uh, bonfire and let's kill that thing. Okay. Well, cool. We've killed a Hydra before. We have. Shouldn't be too difficult. And this looks really pretty. I like that shade of blue. Of sorrow. Oh, yeah. This looks, this looks great. Wow. Okay, so let us tackle the Ash Lake. Don't dive in. No, no, it, it, no. <laughs> Ooh, Definitely don't want to do How do, that. do we kill Hydra? He is in the middle of lake. Well, he is pretty far away, so maybe we can either lure him or we can just pelt him with a bunch of arrows. I'm down for either one. I'll have to come up with a topic to talk about when you start pelting with arrows. How the fuck did I jump so high? There's a good topic. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to assume the game kind of messed up. Oh, will this work? Ow. About to find out. 
Now, the last Hydra we fought, it also had water powered, right? Yeah. It's the it's exact kind of, same thing. This kind of works the exact same way. Oh sense. my god, you found the cheap spot. Did you? Yeah, you did. Yeah, I think I did. Alright, well, as we're just uh, sitting here, let's, let's see if there's any other topics I can bring up. Why do you think Sony's skipping out on E3 this year? Because they have no games. Yeah. Yeah, I was actually thinking that too. That's probably why their their latest E3 was just like three, four games, and it's the same games they've been talking about for like the past four years. Exactly. I mean, I guess they could show more stuff on Last of Us too, but I wonder if they're just gonna do something else instead, like pull a Nintendo Direct report or something. That'd be interesting. I mean, they're not physically going to be there, which means, which I'm hoping that means they're gonna let their their big devs like Naughty Dog and uh, other developers. You know, try their hand at setting up a booth somewhere. Because a recent note from Naughty Dog about Last of Us 2, it is no... It's not that it's not anywhere close to being done, but they'll have an update when they're ready. Close enough. Uh, watch your left. Maybe they'll come and attack me? No, I was just thinking he'll spill water. Oh, you're good. Alright, keep going. Anyway... But, uh, I don't know about you, but uh, here in about a week or so, uh, the Game Awards are going to happen. Uh, those are the corporate ones, right? Pretty much. Yeah, because the game, the Game of the Year award nominees are God of War, Red Dead Redemption Two, the, the typical Spider-Man. Yeah. yeah, the ones that I didn't play. Imagine that. Yeah, they're good games, at least. Yeah. I mean, I assume some people have been buying them. They've been system sellers. I, I don't... Like you know, I'm surprised by this, but I really don't have much interest in Red Dead Redemption 2, to be honest. It's a, it's a slog, from the looks of it. It's, like, I love slow burn games, and I love me some Red Dead Redemption. I think the writing is fantastic. I love me some good westerns, too, you know. But it just seems like it's way too much of a commitment, and I don't have time to commit to that. Okay, so here are the here are the nominees so far because uh, the show is actually tomorrow. Oh well, <laughs> uh, so maybe so... we shouldn't do this, otherwise it'll we'll be dated. <laughs> like you just fucking did, goddamn it. Well, it's all right. So, game of the year nominees: uh, Spider-Man, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, uh, really? Red Dead Redemption Two, Monster Hunter World. That was a weird one. Huh. God of War and Celeste. Celeste, the only indie game on there. Uh, I've heard too many good things about Celeste, but I'm all in, like, the other indie games. What's the one you play? Iconoclast? Iconoclast, yes. So, uh, here's multiplayer games. <laughs> uh, really? Fortnite! Black Ops 4! Monster Hunter World! Wow. Sea of Thieves! <laughs> oh, God! Sea of Thieves came out this year? It did. Oh, my God! Anyway, uh, Destiny 2 Forsaken. That's funny. Uh, I'm glad that uh, Smash is going is not going to be out in time to get in the game because they would probably sweep it. Yeah. Independent games. This is the interesting one. Okay. Celeste. To be yeah. Uh, the Messenger. That's uh, Swearies. Oh yeah. That one. Uh, Into the Breach. Wasn't that wasn't that the missing? Maybe it was. I'm thinking of a different one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that, that's right. Never mind. Uh, Into the Breach, Dead Cells, interesting choice, and uh, Return of the Obra Din. Yeah! Let's get him an award. Go Lucas Pope! Alright, fighting games, uh, Street Fighter V, uh, Fighter Z, uh, Cross Tag Battle, and Soul Calibur VI. Imagine that. Those are the basically the only so fighting games that came out this year. Ones that really matter, uh, sports and racing games. What about Blade Strangers? <laughs> That's a funny one. What about that heroin one from SNK? Yeah, we can, uh, we can go ahead and say those are the only ones that mattered besides the one that comes out in two days. Wasn't there a mobile version of Skullgirls? Anyway, sports and racing games. Now, this is funny to me. So you got 2K19. That's obvious. You got Forza Horizon 4. That's another obvious one. You got FIFA 19. Pro Evolution Soccer 2019, I assume? And Mario Tennis Aces. <laughs> Mario Tennis Aces, obviously. Well, one of these things are not like the other. Uh, well, uh, that'd be Mario Tennis Aces because it's a good game. Ongoing game. Now, this is just uh, funny to me. Games that have longevity. Uh, 
Fortnite, right? Fortnite. Yep. Rainbow Six. Overwatch. Th yeah, that has had longevity. Rainbow Six. Uh, Destiny 2 Forsaken. And this one makes no sense to me. No Man's Sky. <laughs> People thought that that game was dead, but it turns out they just gave us the rest of the game. And now it's yes. just uh, kind of mediocre. Uh-huh. Went from bear to kind of barely a game. Uh, Role-playing game. This is interesting. Uh, These ones, I think. Monster Hunter World. Pillars of Eternity 2. Ooh. Dragon Quest XI. Uh, Nino Kuni 2. Yeah. And Octopath Traveler. I'll throw in my hat for that one. I throw in my hat for Nino Kuni 2. I, I, I kind of like that game. I, I, have you played the first one before? Yeah. I did. Well, the second one is a lot better. You'll be happy to know. I'll take your note, word for it. I, even though I, I think I own No, I don't. I don't have Nino Kuni 2. It's good. It is okay. very good. I, I, I applaud it. It's got a great art style, and it's a hell of a lot more... Like, the way they do side quests in Nino Kuni 2 is a lot better than the first one. Because... The way the first one works, there's like five different gems of five different feelings. Oh. It's like like empathy, happiness, you know, you know, etc. Whatever. It's five types. But the thing is, you have to take the feelings of that from some other NPC. And if some other NPC doesn't like is feeling kind of sad, you have to give it you know that bit of. Well, you can only hold one at a time, pretty much. So it's oh, very very hard. Oh, yeah. It's terrible. And it looks like you are still safe there, so let me go over the other candidates. Family game! Super the Mario, Mario Party. Party! Yeah! yeah. Overcooked 2! I've not played an Overcooked game, but I love me some cooking games, so I'm not gonna yeah. try. Uh, Nintendo Labo. Sure. Sure. Uh, Mario Tennis Aces, imagine that. Mm -hmm. And uh, Starlink, Battle for Atlas. I've actually got that, we might have to try it one day. I wish there were more independent games, but yeah, that's yeah, pretty, it's pretty varied. For, for family specifically. I'm gonna have to give Celeste a try then, if it's, if it's, you know, good enough to bump with the big ones. Which is very surprising. Uh, now for narrative. Ooh, I'll probably love this one. <laughs> God of War. Sure. Which I agree with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Spider-Man, I'll also agree with that one. Haven't played it, but I can just tell it's an insomniac. Yeah, they do good, they, could, they do good work. Uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, obviously Rockstar knows their way around a script. Yep, they've got the story, that's what they're, that's what sets their open worlds apart. Life is Strange 2! Ooh, I haven't tried that yet. Oh, did you do it? Nope, almost. Is that it? Oh, that's oh, it. That is it. I guess I hit him enough times. Yeah. Oh, and the last one was Detroit Become Human. <laughs> Suck a dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay, what's the real candidate? <laughs> okay, okay, it's enough joking around. God, that's funny. Let's see, uh, I don't see any others that are worth talking about. Alright, now we can explore Ash Lake. Ooh, what's that over there? Because now we can explore Ash Lake basically unmolested, and, uh, this leads to a dead end, and we can warp back to Fire Lake Shrine, so we can go towards our third Lord Soul. Ooh! Yes. Excellent. How exciting, you know. I'm good with that. Anyway, I'll probably be watching the Game Awards just to see what announcements come, and if that Crash Team Racing remake is real. You know, I gotta tip my hat to Jeff Keighley. He's like the gaming equivalent of a 7 out of 10. Because he, he's got a lot of charm. He's a great host. You know, but he, he's a bit of a shill, I think. Well, he, he definitely knows how to put up with industry bullshit. Yes. Remember that year he called out Konami? That was gorgeous. Uh-huh, uh -huh, yeah. And that's, Frame it. And that's why he scores so many points in my book. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Dragon scale. Well, there's a lot of dragon scales here. Oh, we gotta, gotta fight a dragon, don't we? Uh, I, think we should, I think we just did, really. Well, the serpent. Well, I'm meaning, like, fly, breathe fire dragon. Yep. A blue eyes white dragon. Alright. Well, we got some Ooh. enemies over here. Ugh. These, uh, wonderful looking things. What are these? Just clams with legs. Oh! Oh, they're probably gonna clamp down on you or something like that. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Whoosh. Oh, that, well, it hurt a pretty good amount. Yeah, I got Nothing. a good amount of poise. That's not bad, though. But Just do they drop heal. something? I don't think they do. Oh, those are skulls. Oh, my. Yeesh. That's some uh, lovely de uh, art design right there. If I do this, it's Yeah, how, how do we make this uh, very... Not creepy, animal creepy. Skulls on the inside. Skulls? Skulls instead of pearls. 
That's just horrific. Wait a minute. What's up with this? I should be having this. I just realized. Twinkling Titanite! Yay! We're doing a lot of Titanite. Maybe we might be able to upgrade some really powerful weapons. Ooh, that looks ominous. I want to see what's in here. I don't think there's a whole lot in here. Yeah. Maybe there is. But hey, we got time to explore after all. This winding hill makes me think there's something underneath the sand and we're just walking on the next boss. That'd be kind of neat. <gasps> Oops. Oh, that looks like it there. It does. It just... My heart stopped for a little bit. Oh, good. Oh, love these guys. Oh, Ooh, love, love that love guy. Guys. Whoosh. Ooh. Okay. Ugh. Come here. Come here. Gotcha. There oh, you go. man. Why? <laughs> Oh, climb another tree. Now, you said this was optional, right? Yes. You're just exploring? Oh, of course. Out of the way, you silly basilisk. Oh, claustrophobic. Uh, wait, what? This lets us gently down here. But we could have gotten there anyway. Well, we got some extra souls out of the deal. No, that's fine. Okay, this. Yes, give me this. Give me another clam or oyster. With its deadly pearls. Yeah. I wish you could harvest them for, like, healing items. Well, you added survival element to Dark Souls? Well, I mean, don't go that far, but I mean... I'd argue it, it's already survival. It's an oyster. You, you know... Or, wait, what am I... Th I'm thinking of mussels. Never mind. Yeah. I don't know my seafood very much. I'm more of a chicken beef guy. Though. I'll take that. Basically eat anything at this point. I'm a garbage disposal. <laughs> Even the greens I hated as a kid. Bring it on. Mm. And cutscene. Let's fight a boss. But eventually... Wait for Ooh, it. Oh, I see it. Is that... Is that a dragon? Oh, my. Oh, my. He's not attacking. That's good. Hi. He is not meant to attack. He is meant to talk. Oh, this is another covenant. Another covenant we can enter. Yeah. Give me some trophy! Path of the Dragon! Alright! Yeah! Entered a yeah! covenant with a dragon! And a dragon has entered a dragon eye. Good. <laughs> and what did we get? What was the new uh, thing that we got? The dragon eye. Oh, the new, I'm uh, sorry, pose. Oh. Did we get another one? I don't think we did. There's like a couple we can do here. Let's add them two more. There you go. Take everything dragon related. I don't need them. Well, I thought it would give me more. Oh, well. No. Well, that, I guess we can go ahead and warp back to the Firelink Shrine. For now, at least. So this is the main reason we came down here? Yeah, that was it. Alright. Came down here to get the Covenant and get a few other extra little things. There might be an item I missed, but if need, if yeah. so, we can just, just go back down there again. Can we warp to that dragon? I don't know. That's so silly. Oh, wait. Yeah, we can. The stone dragon. Oh, okay. That's who that is. Oh, good. So, now we're going back to the Daughter of Chaos. All right. Before we slide off, we're going to take a few tentative steps into the new area we're going to be dealing with. Oh. You don't say. Yep. And that's where we're going to be heading towards the third Lord Soul. Oh, that's the place with all the lava, isn't it? The place with all the lava, the uh, place with all the maggots. This is going to oh, be no. a hell of a good time. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't like it. Yes. We're going to the demon ruins. Oh, we get to fight some demons. Yes. Oh. We don't want to hurt these things. I didn't even know that pathway was there. I can't remember when we were here last. 
We were here after we beat Quillog and we rang the second bell. Then we came here and we turned tail. <laughs> exactly. I can I can definitely see that. So these are still the exploding guys. Yep. Alright. I don't need an example, I believe you. I'm seeing if they explode when they crawl around like that. Because I don't want to get too close. I don't want to agitate them. So we're now getting down to pretty much the bottom of the world, pretty much. Oh god, lava. Because somewhere around here is the Tomb of the Giants. And then we get even deeper to the Lost Diesel, I think my favorite oh, area of the game. Oh no. And... Roadblock! Okay. I'm gonna have to... this thing back on again. What'd you put on? The rest of the iron ring. Now, what's that do again? Let me do this. You're dead. Dead fucking figures. A special other different ring, I think. Uh, what would that be? Or do you know? Uh, I, off I, the top of your head, I don't know if I have it or not. But let me think. We didn't go very far. <laughs> That's we did, good. We did not go very far, no. We oh, uh, do we have uh, fire defense? Da, da, da. Anything that we can wear that gets rid of fire? I guess we could try and put on the best fire defense. A little bit of fire resistance. Buy. Didn't hurt. Even if we got a fat roll again. At least we'll make it through. Potentially. Well, here's hoping. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. So heavy. <laughs> I want to see if I got the ring I'm looking for. So, start from the top. Nope, 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 uh-uh, nope, I didn't it, nope, I didn't it, nope. Wait, Sorry. is there something that, uh, takes off half of our damage? Don't think so. Something I'm missing somewhere. There's our souls down here, though. Oh, good. They didn't put them in the middle of the fire. <laughs> I wouldn't have doubted it if they had done that. So I'm clearly missing something here. And if I am missing something, we can just, you know, save it for next time. Hmm, hmm. Head scratch, head scratch. Puzzling. Excellent. Oh. Go ahead and try it, I guess. You need to make it... Where? Over there? Over there, I'm thinking, but I think we're gonna die before we get that. Oh, give it a shot. I, I, I gotta see this. And... Damn. Well, how about we figure out where we need to get that special ring? Wait a minute. I think I may have missed something. I think I got something totally wrong. It's supposed to be a door we go up. There's a door somewhere around here. There should be at least. Yeah, like through there. Ah, here we go. Oh. Ah. This is what I'm looking for. You know, clonk, uh, clonk. Old clonk, stuff back Clonk. Now. <laughs> clonk. I forgot what I had now. Didn't you pretty much have all of Hobble's things? Yeah, but that makes me heavy. Now I'm light again. This looks about right, I'd say. Oh dear. Here we are, going further into the demon ruins. Giant ahead. Weakness fleeing. Great. I don't see any giant. Okay. Unless we're on his back right now, in which case, this game just got amazing. Okay. And boom! And... Boom! Okay. Fucking hell. Hi. 
Are you friend or foe? Is this another covenant? Sorrow ahead. <laughs> That's ceaseless discharge. We gotta run. Oh! Oh, God. Holy shit! We gotta go. We gotta go. go. Oh, oh, my geez. God! This we demon go. looks cool. Oh, boy. God. Love his name, too. Yeah, what a great name. Yeah, ceaseless discharge. <laughs> Owie, man. I don't know why you would have a name like that, but it looks so cool! It's like a giant fighter fire spider on the back of a cyber demon. Oh! oh! Oh, I love how he only started attacking once we stole his stuff. Okay. It hurts. Okay. It hurts. Yipe, 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 yipe. Now, can we kill Ceaseless Discharge? We can. Just not now. We can kill him. Absolutely, we can. Are we going to? I hope. <laughs> I really hope to. That was a cool looking monster. Get back there and kill him. Or is he still. He's still coming. Oh, he coming. Oh, he killed me. Can, you, can you go back through? Or is he just gonna find you anyway? Here he comes. Look at that thing. He's coming. And fire. And, and fire. Holy shit. That was awesome. And that's awesome right there. Look at his face. What? That's it. What? How in the hell? <laughs> yeah. Ah. That's what we had to do. We had to get rid of Ceaseless Discharge to make the lava go down? Mm-hmm. Because now that the discharge has, well, ceased. ceased. Exactly. Now we can make our way around. Yeah. All right. Well, that was really awesome. Yeah, it was. Now, did his arm get stuck in there? And that's how you were able to kill him like that? Or it... you just knew he didn't have a lot of hit points? See, I think he was trying to reach for me or whatever. I think that's just a way to quick kill him. Oh, okay. But you gotta be strong enough in order to withstand his attacks when you're running away from him. Gotcha. So. That was something, wasn't it? Yeah, that was cool. All right. Well... I think that's about all we can manage for right now, at least. Because, uh, we got, we got a long way to do, go down here. See all those things down mm -hmm. there? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So we're practically in hell, pretty much. Sweet. And, you know, I'd, I'd, I'd be in hell, too, if I had to deal with this on my back all day. Oh, why would you kill one of those things? Oh, no. Ew. Gross. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna have all the maggots following me. It's gonna be great. Yeah, you, you're not even getting, like, anything for this, are you? No soul drain. That's what I'm looking for. Ew. Why would you want those? I'm gonna do it like this. Oh. Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Wow, those are not yeah. worth anything. No, it isn't. These are more of a nuisance than anything else. Yeah. And they're actually killing you. Yeah, yeah, they do They do hurt quite a bit. I will not lie about that. Oh my god, you're gonna lose to maggots. They're definitely difficult to hit, too. So, respawn. Doo -doo. Cool. There, nothing to it. Please don't do that again, please. Alright. So we'll see you next time on Let's Play Dark Souls, and we'll probably hopefully get a third Lord Soul, or get close to doing it. See you next time.